So today I'm building the um, last frame. I was hoping to build two of these, but it's just time constraints. We're going to have to double up on the back of that to, for load mirrors or something. And, um, <coughs> and once that's done, I'll frame it up. The bottom part has already been done by a big chippy. And uh, once this is all done, then we can get to set dressing and then I, at daytime to work on the props. And at night time, I go back to the house. And um, tonight I'm going to show you a little bit what I do back at the house on the computer, showing you how I do it. So as you can see here, I've just been doing some shading and stuff, like when you start to dress it slightly. And this is the other side from the prison that you've seen. So as you can see now, this is getting to detailing work, just all pallets and netting and a few old pulleys. It's not, it's only random, but it's supposed to sort of, with the set decoration, you can see the shading. Um, it's because of 3D, 3D lights a lot better. So we tend to use that. On the other side is the interior of the pub, which I'll be doing over the next couple of days. But this is nearly sort of finished because I just want that oldy feeling. And we've got barrels, <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> we've got barrels that, uh, that uh, will be fitted in real barrels, which will just make the massive difference. I think mean, a lot of uh, places, a lot of sets, but I think it'll look fantastic. I only stuff. Mm, I like that. It's okay. It's just very rough, and that's exactly my intentions. So I'm here in the office, uh, going back over some stuff now. I, I spend most of my days at the club, and then I um, and then I come and work in my office, my strange little office. And some of the modelling skills that you can see there. <laughs> That's what we've used now in the vlogs where you've seen me do the upscaling versions of old rocks and stuff like that. Um, so I spend a lot of my times morning up till mid-afternoon today I was at the club and then now I'll work here until late. Um, I'll show you a few little bits if you want me to. I'll show you where we're up to on here. Right, so if I go back into the files that I'm working on, start, these are my files, which my dump files, which get dumped down onto uh, HD cards and stuff. So um, Starlight we've only just started working on, but if you go to, say, the King Arthur show, the Sunday show, and go to movies, you can see there's quite a lot of routines have been done there. And again, some of these could actually not end up in the shows because we're just throwing loads of ideas at it, the dog show. And that's got quite a lot on as well. Uh, Pirates, the Pirates Rock show. Again, I've thrown quite a lot of songs at that one and we'll just see. Um, it's just giving you an idea that with Phantom Mansion, I've done a lot of the, some of the daft effect shots and not like Hollywood effects, just just some stuff. But there's quite a, there's quite a lot in there. And um, I'll show you a couple of examples in a minute. Uh, the musicals, I've done an old classicals one that we would expect to see, and we're doing some new new stuff as well. And, uh, and again, fun. And then the wheels coming back of misfortune. So I can show you a couple of little bits while we're here. If I go to, say, let's go to Phantom Mansion, which we were just working on, there's certain little bits where we've got some scary ghosts uh, what well, look if you were just watching them in a movie they would be too scary for the kids but there's actually comedic things going on at the same time Do you see some of the effects where the ghost comes out so we're hoping it's going to be Doctor Who scary you know for the kids because um, he ends up doing silly things you know with umbrellas and stuff and it's not it's I think it'll be scary but hopefully that's that's the sort of idea you know but there's something comedic going on at the same time as this is happening with our performance so it's just basically like Disney haunted mansion type of thing it's behind you and not all of these will make the cut um, you've got the, you've got effects um, you've got little effects where you, because we're doing this sort of Ghostbusters riff on it, you'll start to see people, you know, where you think it's going to be scary, and then it, of course you see who it is. And we've got effects, just little bits and, and stuff where he's going to get zapped. Which is all in the Ghostbusters show. You see, there's all sorts of different things coming on. But I don't want to show you everything, and there's explosions and things, and I'm bringing back new versions of old stuff, but. Um, there's a little bit of everything for everyone, so 
um, that's what I'm working on so I just carry on now and I'm in my editing suite I use a, the latest pinnacle with lots of add-ons and um, if I open so as you can see um, we're still full on we're still full at it we're looking forward to the the um, welcome winter show on the 10th so that should be good it should be pretty full all the tickets have sold I know there's a few people who can't go but some of those tickets have been resold so <clears throat> we're working very hard for you to come down and see our shows again this summer and as particularly as usual we just keep tweaking them until we get them right or I will anyway so well we hope you've enjoyed tonight's little blog and um, it'll get more exciting as we get a bit closer now because I'm finishing the last of the props as you saw today well the basis of the props and then anything else that we add to that extra will be coming in I'm still trying to buy costumes and some different stuff to show some stuff that we've never shown before and this year we've put it together with a hint when we say the Phantom Mansion it'll have a hint of what we've done in our haunted house shows with a little bit of comedy but some of the old shows when I've gone back and looked at them are not very PC anymore and they're not they're not they're, they're, well they were, they were pretty pretty terrible <laughs> in the actual fact a more modern audience wouldn't stand for that so we've got those elements in here but we've also to mix it up and we'll get some uh, great singing and routines and silly script in that as well because of course in the shows there are there are brand new material in in, in every one of the shows uh, but the there the, some that's got got the old flavor of, of some of them there's a hint of that but it's still completely redone every track has been redone and um, and of course mostly new material mostly new material or a new fresh on approach on that material well we hope you've enjoyed the vlog so um they will get more and more interesting now as we get to that time because um as we start this start we're starting to get to the point now we're physically putting everything together and so it's getting more fun see you in a bit